Hello everyone, welcome to another video. Uh, this video is about the error. Let me just show you that. Uh, this is the error. No integration defined for root with ID. Uh, here's some ID and key get slash list. So as you can see, I have an API gateway. Uh, I have an uh, endpoint for the API gateway for list and uh, I'm calling the method get. So when I try to deploy this, I get this error, no integration defined for root ID and then get list. So uh, what I did is I have already added an uh, authorization. So you have uh, See, I already have uh, created an integration. So uh, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to uh, have an API gateway endpoint and uh, uh, whenever a user hits that endpoint, I want to call a Lambda function. So uh, I have already defined the integration. So you can see here, uh, this is the Lambda function I want to call and I just tested and verified it, it is working fine. Uh, here is my uh, API gateway endpoint. So as you can see here, this is my URL. So here I'm not getting any messages uh, because I, it is not deployed. So when I try to deploy this, I get an error. Okay, so how to fix it? If you have uh, not created any inti uh, integration, uh, go ahead and check here, manage integrations. If you do not have anything in this dropdown, you first have to create another one. So the button is right here, so you can create it. Since I've already done it, uh, anyway, let, let me click this button for you. So you can either integrate with uh, HTTP URI or private resource or Lambda function. I have done it for Lambda function. So uh, yeah, so I, it's shown here. So to fix this issue, what you need to do is uh, you have to just click on manage Int integrations and uh, select the integration. So I want to call the Lambda function, so I'll select this right okay now let's deploy this deploy to dev yeah i think it is not saved so yeah if it is successful, you will see this uh, in this details uh, list, you will see this integration details for route get slash list. Okay. So make sure you get this uh, details and then you try to deploy it. And then successfully updated dev stage with the new deployment. Okay, once you are deployed this, go ahead and test it. I'm not sure why this is not working. Still getting, getting not found here. So guys, I was uh, I have not added the endpoint after the URL. 
so after adding the endpoint i can see the response okay so make sure you do that and uh, hope this helps in fixing the issue uh, thank you thanks for watching